Hi everyone and welcome to a new video of plant chess. In this video I'm going to prune this plant, the Philodendron Painted Lady. It would really help me if you could subscribe to my channel and give a thumbs up to this video. Let's get started! So this is the Philodendron Painted Lady and it's got its name from these beautiful leaves that have a mosaic-like pattern. So I actually got this plant for my work as two small cuttings and it grew so big in just a few months that it actually outgrew the plant stake. So I want to uh, prune it now because I want to make it smaller and I want to make new plants out of it. The propagation of this plant or any philodendron in general is really easy. You just want to make a cut in the stem between two nodes and then you want to propagate the top cutting for, uh, in water for instance and uh, the part that's still on the plant will uh, grow out uh, a new branch or a new part of the stem. To prune this plant you need a uh, pair of pruning scissors and you just need to think where you want to make the cut. So since I have a uh, beautiful plant support in here, I want to make the cut uh, close to the plant support or at least uh, take off the part of the stem that grows uh, too high. Here we have two nodes and you want to cut in between uh, the two nodes. And from the, the node that will remain on the plant, a new part uh, will grow out and you can um, make cuttings from the part that you uh, cut away. So I'm going to prune it now. So it's off and um, this part I actually want to uh, make multiple cuttings from this one. So for each cutting you can uh, yeah, well, you need at least one node. Um, and what's funny is that from some nodes, these little worms that can grow out to be roots, they are already growing from it. So I think I will make a new cut here. So let's give that as well. So essentially, I have two cuttings now. So on this side, I'm, it's not so big yet, but um, yeah, I'm going to uh, prune it because it will grow big anyway. So I think, let me see, maybe here. Okay, so here I have another uh, cutting. So I have made uh, three cuttings and what you want to do is put these cuttings in water with at least uh, or preferably uh, one node because from these nodes uh, then uh, roots will grow. So I think I will just put them in this glass of water. Just make sure that from each cutting uh, make sure that from each cutting uh, at least one node is in the water so that the roots can grow from there. And let me pick up this last one. I think I will just to shove it in a bit so yeah we'll wait uh, until they're rooted and we have to wait until a new part grows from these yeah from these nodes yeah and then we have to wait until the end result so yeah Woo! we're back it took some weeks of waiting but we finally have the results of the propagation of the philodendron painted lady so we both see growth on the mother plant as well as on the cuttings. So from the two mother plants where the cuttings have been made from, there are three parts where new branches have formed. So here on this plant, from this node, there is one uh, small branching out as well as on this plant there are two. So here from this node, you can already see uh, one leaf growing. And from this top part here, there's also some new growth that can be seen. As for the cuttings, they are still in the glass jar that I put them in and they have grown so many roots on the node and they are ready to be potted into a pot. Uh, and I will show you how I did that as well.
Thank you for watching this video on the propagation of the Philodendron Painted Lady. If you've enjoyed it, make sure to subscribe to my channel and give a thumbs up to this video. Have a look around and start to grow your knowledge. Bye!